and good evening gaming fans well this is going to be a bit of a controversial video because I've seen the comments already left by you guys on the very first video we did of this Age of Empires Castle Seed and so for a lot of you are hating the idea of this game I think you're waiting for the uh, domination uh, which has seem to be lost in development hell at present moment I did look on the Facebook account for the game because uh, I seen one or two mention it what's happening to it and by the looks of it the last post on that page was done last year in 2014 so either it has been quietly dropped or well it's still in development site the hell as they call it so I thought I would check this one out to see what all the fuss is about um, due to the comments being left by you guys. So I will probably be stoned to death and burned at the stake when I upload this video and you going, what on earth are you doing Brian? Why are you, if you're playing this kind of garbage? So this is going to be my first look at the game myself and what I, what I think of it. Now I understand from reading on the various pages I've come across about this game you can play this on your PC as well if you've got Windows 8 and when I first started this game um, I did ask me if I wanted to use an Xbox Live account or whatever it is that they use over there Xbox on my OS yes very nice I think not so yeah you can actually play this on a cross platform so you can play this on your iPad or you can play this on your PC via Windows 8 I don't know about any other Windows if it's supported so I don't I'm not sure about that and what I've done is I've picked Britain because I'm a Brit. Go on, son. And I'm going to see how this plays out. We're, we're playing the Brits. So, I will now duck and cover as I get stoned to death by you, uh, you guys as I play this. But anyway, let's see what it's like. Um, I believe there is a one unique feature in this from reading the view, reading reviews, reading some of the previews. And that is regarding selecting your troops and where you move them. But more on that when I come to it. So, we away we go. So, we play with Barons. Um, this is number one. Okay, so welcome to the age of Empires, Castle Siege, build up your castle, advance through the ages, and crush your enemies. Fair enough, I suppose. It's, as you say, it all looks quite uh, spangly tastic here, isn't it, really? Nice. It's quite, uh, yep, of course, typical CNC type uh, um, layouts you know it's very responsive so far so look at that one in out in out in out right okay enough of that Brian sorry <laughs> okay so we also press a button and away we go so the key is to advancing your castle before you can upgrade you must learn how to produce and harvest resources you don't say <laughs> okay so away we go right let's go to market and build a mill okie dokie it's all, all very nicely laid out, isn't it? Okay, so 1, 1, and 14. I, there must be the ones that I can build. So let's go to economy. And oh, I can build a mill. Kidoki. And I take it uh, once again. It's not bad. So actually, you can move it around fairly quick there. You can see. Not too bad there. And okay, so um, I don't know. Let's just place it there for the time being because we don't know what else we're doing yet. Okay, it's so a place. Your mills in construction, why wait? You can, uh, why, but why wait? Any bones can be instantly completed with gold. Yeah, of course, but guess what? It's done. Thank you. And uh, productive completed. Okie dokie. So, what's next? Congratulations, you've built the mill. Now you can produce wood. Here is your gold reward. Hey, excellent. Okay. Right. Uh, all resources that can be produced must be collected and moved into storage so you can use them. Fair enough. Okay, so I guess. Okay, um, burning resources takes time. Yep, when, re when resource burning has enough resources, it's 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 collected. Button activates. Okay, right. Once a whole lot of resources are on the resource building, an icon appears over the top of the building. Okay, right. I think that's what I mean. Okay, right. Now let's collect. Okay, so collect some. Okay. Right, so collecting some apples, and as you see in the resource area, it's about full. Okay. 
Oh, thank you. I got some extra resources. Okay, and yep, I'm now at nearly 400 max. Okay, the more you upgrade your storage buildings, the more resources you can collect, allowing you to build bigger and better things. Well, that's obvious, really, of course. Okay, right, fair enough. Okay, let's uh, start your lumber yard and then press click upgrade button to level it up. Once the upgrade is complete, you have more storage. Okay, so, right. Um, okay, so finally you lumber yard, which must be the ah, this is the big thing down here, which is highlighted, so press that. And upgrade. Now this is a novelty thing. Now I uh, let's see, it's actually asking me to use my typical um resources. Now I wonder if the gold is is a um an IAP purchase. I think it is actually. Anyway, let's continue on. So there we go, we uh, bit stats here on how you to upgrade your level 2, let's do that please then. And away we go. And uh, let's select your own board, okay, upgrade if you want to. And it cost me one gold. Mm, that's not too bad actually, but let's wait for it to finish anyway. Heck with it. Won't take that long. And we're done, there we go. So great job, you have increased your wood storage by increasing your storage capacity. You can build higher level structures and upgrades. Okay, fair enough, nice. In addition to resources, your empire's economy can produce gold. Ah, okay, this is interesting. Right, okay. Connecting your roads to trade routes and uh, trade route markets gives you daily influx of this precious commodity. So this is interesting, so you can actually earn gold very quickly by sounds of it, okay. Go to market and build a road, connect through enough road pieces to form a line from your keep to the connectors. So that must be like Okay, I assume them must be connected. Okay, so go to there, economy, and road. Okay, and there we go, it's highlighted. So, ah, okay, so if I zoom down here, hang on, where's my, if I move that over here, please, thank you, and do, whoops, and do that one there, okay, press that, and, okay, well done, your road will now produce gold every day. Check, uh, you know, check, Keep once a day and collect the gold by tapping the gold icon. Right, thank you. And well done, and here's one of his reward. Oh, thank you. Okay, enemies marching on your castle. Many people want to attack you and put on your resources. Yeah, gang on. Let's get rid of that, thank you. Okay. You can, your own defense is the building fortify. Uh, try again. Your only defense is the buildings fortifications to protect your keep and buildings. Okay. Right, so that must be just my HQ, right. Go to market, build an archer tower and defend yourself. Mm, okay, fair enough. Standard thing as like CNC ago, so let's go to it. And we can only build that arch tower. Okay, and fair enough, big range there. Um mm, any mini anyway, where do you put it? Mm, I suppose well there that's that we do. Okay, when construction your archer tower is complete, it will defend your castle. I hope so, that's the idea. And I'm still not going to use my uh, gold either. I'm going to let that build because it's not going to take too long. Okay, that's done. Right, and oh, another objective completed. Okay, your arch tower attacks and mid range. Place your towers to protect as many buildings as possible. Keep, especially the keep. Right, so obviously, I suppose my next one will be down here somewhere to protect them three buildings which are not protected. Okay, you can fill the range with tower and over defenses by selecting them. Right, thank you. Enemy approaches, your tower will defend the castle. I hope so. That's the idea, isn't it? Really? Yeah? Here, and here they come. Whoa! Here they come. Let's zoom into it. And God, that's small. They are small, aren't they? Yeek! Doesn't... They are small. They, they don't really look really meaty. Let's see what happens then. And... Engage. There we go. Cool. I have to admit, yeah, they aren't... Graphics are a bit mm, on the wee on the wee side, aren't they, really, folks? I can see why you're uh, going. Ugh. Okay. Well, still, we are defending the uh, castle. Uh, okay, you successfully defended your castle. You can also launch attacks of your own by training armies. Okay, okay. Okay. Here's some food to help you out. Oh, thank you very much. Okay, so you need an army camp, right? You can train any type of troop you have unlocked in your troop buildings. Okay, leveling up your troop buildings unlocks more troops and troops. Blah. Okay, right. And since you already have a troop building, I do, do I? The barracks, you have troops are available to train as soon as you build an army camp. I guess that's my barracks then. 
Okay, right. So let's go and build. Let's give the market. Sorry, and build an army camp. So I presume that must be my barracks, and indeed they are. There we go. So need to go and build an army camp. Okay, this is the staging area, of course. And oh, that's yes. That looks a bit. That looks nice. Connected to light. That looks nice. Light, doesn't it? Really. Um, let's stick it there. Why not? And okay. When your army base is constructed, you can train troops. Yay! There we go. So we're getting there, aren't we, folks? Notice the build capacity. We can actually build up to four items at once. Now, that is a nofty one, because normally it's either one or two, depending on what game you play. So a plus there for me on that one. I like that. You build an army. Uh, you can train armies here to attack your enemies. Upgrade your army camp allows you to hold more troops. Right. Time to train your troops uh, so you can defect the attack. Other players. Okay. Select an army camp and select click or press or click the my my button and then train some troops. Keep train troops to fill up your camp. Okay, yes, I need to say click or press because obviously if you're playing on a PC you will be using your mouse. So I suppose, you know. Okay, so they go to train troops. And we have two lots of troops there, so does it say anything else? Does it say we'll take the troops we want to train up? And train up some troops. Didn't say which ones though. Um, I'm going to. Okay, let's go for six of these then, I guess. One, two, uh, uh, uh. Okay. No, thank you. Don't want to upgrade it. Right. You can speed up the gold. Oh, so you can use gold to speed up the training. Let's have a look. But, um, let's go back to training and what we're going to spend is two gold. Um, 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 let's see how quick he's going to make it. Is it going to be, uh, come on, come on, see, it's going to be three, two, one, two. Ah, uh, because that's speed up there for a heck of it. That's it. Yes, please, I want to finish it because it's going to be, we want to uh, get on in this video. And I'm sure you don't want to sit there watching me just train troops. Okay, your arm's now ready to battle the enemy. You don't say. Okay, let's go attack. To make your first battle easier, you've been given a temporary army. Oh, a temporary big army. That's handy. To spawn troops, you use the troop buttons to select the troop type and then tap on the screen to where you want to deploy them. Okay, right. Press or click the attack button to go to war. I'm playing the enemy. Okay, so that's over there then. And uh, let's have a look. Okay, deploy your troops. Right, so we've got a bigger army here. So we've got... I have no idea what these troops do because it's in towers. And, well, basically there's just one defence, so I'm surely the thing is to go after... Okay, deploy troops. Okay, so I guess I will deploy these first. Go... Uh -huh. Control troops by... Okay, ah, okay, so... If I, uh, oh, hang on. That's like that. Okay, and what do you deploy more? And that's like that. Uh, okay, and what's this? Deploy him. Special abilities. Oh, he's a hero. Okay, right, so he's a hero, so... Like so. There we go. Now I can't hear the sound in this at present moment because I'm recording this, so I'm playing this literally in silence, so I don't know what it sounds like at present moment. It seems a bit... I have to admit though, I aren't impressed with the graphics. Not not the army, so they do seem rather small, which, you know, seems a bit odd to me, but... Still. We should see how we do. Well, well I think that's about dead. Now, I have to admit, one thing that's going to catch me out is now you can move your troops wherever you want them. Notice this, and that's great, but as long as you you don't get too excited and like go, wee like this kind of thing, and we try and move your troops, that's the only thing about that. But I like how you can sort of, ah, interesting, we can move more around. Hmm, okay. Right, so use 5, 1, oh, did I lose them? I might have lost them. Now, the question is, do I, now, I don't ever get these ones back, I, I won't do, of course. Okay, attacking and looting other castles is a great way to increase your resource. Okay, right. But but be sure to target the keep to gain the ward chest for destroying it. Okay. You're doing fantastic here, some rewards. Oh thank you. Okay, now now you can upgrade the keep upgrading the keep advances the age and unlocks new buildings. Okay. And uh, select press and click the upgrade button and when you complete it you will reach the next age. Okay. Now I wonder with this if it would be the same principle as all the other games is upgrade you keep at the last possible time, I wonder. So let's upgrade. 
400. Okay, and there we go, lots of stats and what we get, increase in health, damage per second, uh, pennant, pennant capability, Don't know, I'm not sure that is, and then we have other stuff that we can do as well, looks like more farms, resources, towers, ah, tower there, that's always handy, and away we go. So, um, now it's going to take us, let's see now, 36 seconds, um, Let's upgrade that as quick as we can. Why not? Yes, go on for one gold, not too bad. Okay, so now in the Dark Ages. Dark Ages are past. Worlds are gathering increasing lands while in the East, new religion sets off. Is it's a wallet expansion? Is hmm okay. oh new religion sets off. Oh okay, sorry. Islam expansion. Pardon me for my English here. Yeah. Okay, so religion's involved in this. Hmm. Right, your keep has been upgraded. Okay. Visit of people's castles is a great way to see how layouts and defences in... Oh, sorry. Visit of people's castles is a great way to see how they lay out their defences and engaging battle. Okay. You can review replays of them attacking and defending. Okay. Let's visit a high player's castle and watch a replay. Well, that's an interesting idea. Okay, let's go and do that then, shall we? Okay, and oh my good grief, that is a very nice castle. What, what's going on here? Oop, there's lots of. This obviously, is, this is a, a very high end castle indeed. I'm watching a replay of it uh, being attacked by. Good grief, and let's just zoom out. Is anything else going on here? No, just the castle. Just, just, just down this end. And um, there goes a the corner wall. Whoa, siege towers. Hey, up. This is, seems like a bit fun. Got siege charge coming in here. No, that's no, that's a oh, very quifty over the siege towers, over the wall, and in you go, folks. Now that's an the idea. Hmm, this might have some legs. This will, I think, if you're prepared to uh, invest some time in it, though. But uh, good grief! This is all. This is a big raid, or but hmm. So catapults can fire over walls, okay. Siege towers can get over walls as well. And then more troops down here. And oh, hey, up over the tower. Nice. Even more uh, room to get over the over the walls. Okay, and in, in so the walls aren't in or the walls are uh, can be quite easily breached. Good grief, there's a lot going on here and still going in that corner. In go the uh Brazilian the uh, battering rams just got in there. And they're throwing in more rocks. And this is there's a lot going on here, folks. A lot going on here with this, but I can't keep up going on here. But boy, good grief! So I imagine war defenses will be a good idea if you can keep them out. <laughs> and there goes the the HQ. So the case of now ripping the place apart, I think. Hmm. This might have some legs if you prepare to play it, because I know a lot of people are going yuck. But that looks quite impressive how they did that, especially with troops over the, over the walls with the uh, siege towers. I like that. But obviously, troops on their own get slaughtered if they try and uh, notice that it's quite quickly. So you're going to need heavy artillery to uh, breach the walls by the looks of it. Hmm. Okay, let's continue on because that is like, oh my good grief. Nicely defended, well, it was a nicely big area, but it soon got breached. Right, so let's continue on, because uh, so there's a lot there to learn already. Hmm. Bigger castles can engage in bigger and more epic battles. You don't say that. <laughs> that was pretty epic, I think. Okay. Right. Continue to upgrade your keep buildings and troops to get awesome defences and buildings unstoppable and un un build, sorry, unstoppable armies. Okay. Here's some wood for help you along. Right. Now you're ready to build your castle. Sorry. Now you're ready to build your castle up to the mighty fortresses. Advance through the ages to crush your enemies. Right. And there we go. I am now on my own. Yikes. Okay. So click that. And so what do I do? Hmm, where do I go from here? Let's have a look around. You're not in alliance, find one now. You're no pending invites. Okay. 
Um, search for lines. Hey, tell you what, friends, my friends. Hmm, says what friends. I don't know these people. I know. Do I know these people? Maybe not. You know what? That's Queen Alliance. So that's um, let's see now. We would call this uh, touch game play. There we go. Okay. Um, touch gameplays. Gameplay. Touch gameplays. Very own alliance. There you go. I think that's bad. And select logo. Um, be, 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 let's have that one because I'm British. So there you go. Have that. And anyone can join. Invite only. You know, anyway, go. Anyone can join. I think. Yeah, go on. Or I suppose. And let's put invite only. So if you want to join, guys, then send me send me a request if you want to if you want to play it, and maybe you can hook up together. So that's great. You answered from Great Teach. Yay! So there we go. We're, we now got Alliance running. Okay. So um, nothing. Alliance messages. Nothing there. So okay. And okay, so I'm um, level one. Um, search for alliances, none at all. So I'm wondering if, mind you, this game just only come out a few days ago, so there's probably not a chance for people to have a go with this yet. What's next? Let's have a look. That's defense log, attack log, empty. Okay, and what got it? My army. Okay, and we have here. Ooh, okay. Ah, okay. We have battles, which I presume will be, of course, the random, the against the, excuse me, against against the people. And historic challenges, which obviously is the PVE stuff. So standard stuff there again as always. Um and that's what else what else got down here? We got oh we got alliances. It's only me. Okay. <laughs> uh achievements. Okay, so we've gone through the dark ages, win through battles in historic campaign, loot, etc. 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 Okay. Objectives. Ah, so that's what we can aim for. Upgrade, upgrade your mill, fortresses, beach. Beach cast ten times in multiplayer battles. Oh, bre breach. Sorry, breach. Sorry. Uh, age up. Sack of the castle. Okay, so there's wins. Where's wins to win more gold? Uh, lots of ways to win more gold there. Okay. And what else we got down there? We got settings. So everything there. Standard stuff, really. Um, okay, leaderboard. Um, good grief. Oh, that's the uh, oh, right. top license there. Let's look at top players. Okay, we have got. Oh, hey, up. Notice these people are playing on Xbox. Because actually, this game has been available on Windows, I think, for a while actually already. Or a Windows phone. So I'm not surprised we've got people using uh, Xbox logs in. So can we look at him? Let's go visit. Visit, please. Let's have a look at this guy. And see how we're doing. Let's see how this guy does. Rolls and ooh, bloody hell! Excuse my language, but <whistles> that is a pretty hard defending base. I don't think I can be reading that one <laughs> somehow. But good grief, that is a well with defending base. And note how they are doing the old, um, what do you call it, square defense kind of maneuver? You know, square. Oh, I think I think off is in blocks kind of thing. So let's go back. And let's have another one while we're here. Let's have a look at another one. Oh, okay. Let's go. Come. Let's go back and leaderboard. And go and look at another one. This one from I believe Zim is Brit. Uh, nope. Back. I want to. Can I just. Oh, no. Sorry. Sorry. That's, that's alliances. Let's look at this guy and let's go and visit him. See how he's doing. Good grief. <coughs> this is his sound. And ooh, same principle there. Nice little ward off. And woo. Lots of stuff there. Okay, right. So enough of that. Let's go back to us and see. Okay, and what else do we have? We have a little bit of news. And a month of contest is now gone. Visit a Empire's blog for details and how to enter. And list of prizes including 250 gold for Castle Siege. Don't miss out on the fun and chance to win some great prizes. Okay, right. So there's that there. And there we go. So it's just that. So hmm. I guess I must be. What's this? Is this a peace thing? I guess that time up there means I can't be attacked for one hour and 35 minutes, which is not much really. Um, okay, and what we got here? Collecting penance in battle by destroying by destroying the research buildings, and keep penance are used to unlock items for other other civilizations. Okay, right. So that's something around to uh, keep uh, keep in mind. Right. So we'll go to here. 
on it. What's on it? On it is, oh, I guess these must be um, what you call um, decorations, I guess. Okay. Fortifications. Okay. Another archer tower would need, would definitely need one of them. Patrol points. Uh, that's obvious, but that's going to be then. Uh, wars. We're uh, going to need them as well. So, okay. And a commonly, we can build another farm and a mill. Okay. And military. I guess that means an archer range, which will be handy later. Okay, so I suppose the hmm, first thing we could really do is build another arch tower. Now that let's place that about there, and then they should cover. Set so place that there, and let's have a look. That covers that one, and that covers that one over there. And it's, can I move this? No, I just move. That's better over there. Thank you. There we go. That's it, and that will take me three, two, one, and we're done. There we go, so that's now, so we've got that covered there, covered there, so we've got the area covered for the time being. Okay, so, what else can I build next, or grade, let's see, military, build, archer range, I can't yet, because I've got enough uh, room, I need to upgrade my storage areas, okay, um, anything else I can use, economy, build another farm, um, and build another mill, mm, b -b 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 now is that, 20, oh sorry, so, um, let's see what I, well, can I build 125, thing is, let's see, troops wise first, let's look at troops and go to train, it's still full, okay, so, right, um, I don't want to go nuts and spend all my uh, food and I have nothing left over, so, let's go back to here, let's see what we can build, um, actually not recommended, so let's go and do one of these historic fights first, I think, oops, wrong button, Get to fight. Okay, so we got historic challenges. I'm not going to try and find a battle yet because I don't think I'm going to be up to it yet. So, right, historic campaign. Okay, um, I guess we'll just go here. Oh, right here. This is interesting. You need to upgrade your keep to uh, age four. Oh, okay. So I can't actually do that then. Is there anything else? I can say anything else? Age, age five, age five. So I can't do the historic campaigns. Hmm. Okay. Um. Well, there's going to be way too instant god from somewhere. So I guess it's going to force me into doing PvP straight away, which I don't like that room. What system? Okay. So build a hall of heroes to unlock heroes for battle. Okay. Right. So you've got six troops. Um. All right. Final battle. You have activated peace treaty. If you attack now, your peace treaty will be cancelled and you will be subject to uh, attacks. Continue? No, for the time being. Well, th there's not much you can do because, um... What can I do? There, there's nothing I can do. I'm not going to wait around. So, I'm, I'm going to have to. So, yes. Okay, so that's a bit pants, really. Okay, deploy your troops. So uh, let's have a look. Now, if I want to move on, this is going to cost me ne next. It can cost me food. Okay, so deploy my troops, and there. There you go, thanks. And oh. There we go. Deploy, attack that, please. Attack that. There we go. So away we go, and hopefully, let's see how we do. And take that down first, and there we go, and then the place is mine, there we go, right, so onwards, away we go. There's no speed up button for this either, so, hmm. Now the thing is going to be is afterwards, is uh, do I get my troops back, we should find out once I've done this attack. Take that out first, but, thank you. There we go, there's the food coming down. I'm going to max out my food here quite quickly and my uh, water by looks of it. But this is what I need, apparently. That's a bit odd, though, why you can't actually do PvE straight away. That would have been better than trying to get you combat, because I can see you can end up getting smacked quite early on. Still, doesn't matter, we have to do it as we have to play it as the game insists we play it. So I've maxed out on my food. Now, next thing you need to do is max out on my wood. There goes the. Um, Keep, so to speak, that's been destroyed, and I get a reward. Ooh, 
I find out what that is, I suppose, when I've finished this. So onwards we go. We're keeping now we just clear out the rest of the rest of the base. There we go. Over there, please, folks. Say so there's no speed up as far as I can see, so this bit is a bit of a like just hang around and wait for it to finish off. Okay. So once again, I haven't got no idea how the sound like because I'm playing this um, where I can't have any sound on. Long story why that is fixed, but yeah, so I'm playing in pitch sounds, so it's a bit weird this. Now let's see, and oops, now I'm going to see how... Mmm. Ah, that's interesting how you can do that. So you can actually, literally, take trips where to go. So if you want to avoid a particular area, say that tower over there, for example, you can literally sort of tr tell them literally where you want them to go. So that's a good idea, I like that. Okay, so you're going to gonna max out on the wood here. Okay, so if I do this... Hmm, that's good, I like that idea. So that's the sort of the the thing that stands out from the others, and I can leave that alone. Yeah, I'll leave that alone. So let's just just do that quick. Go on, folks. Moseying down down there, and let them uh, flatten that. Because I want the wood. I want the wood. That's the main thing I want. I'm not going to retreat. I will just carry on and take them out. There we go. Take that out. And then max out to my uh, food save for, okay. Two stars, so what, one more, and I'm at, well, I suppose that's going to have to be that thing over there, isn't it, really? Okay, so, and then it's just that. Are they going after that? Yeah, they're going after that, so. There you go, folks, take that out before you get killed. I still don't know, they do seem really, really small, but then seeing how that mega com how that epic combat was, I suppose that's why they're so small. And, oh dear, they're getting... They don't, come on, engage, take him out. Oh dear, they're getting flattened. There we go. The, I th ah, there's also a range on these towers, I think. Or maybe... Maybe there's a range. Don't know. But anyway, that's that done. And we won! Yay! Okay, so victory. And I lost... And what's this we get in the chest? Woo! Well, that's really useful, because now we're maxed out already. So that's really, really useful. Not... Oh dear, okay. Yes, I also need some more work on it, folks. So, I'm maxed out. Oh, I've. Um, okay, so I don't need. Right. Let's go back to troops. And. Uh, let, oh, no, 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 no. Let's go back to troops. I want to see. And. Yep. As I feared, you don't get troops back once you've uh, um, used them. So. No, I'd like to know what can I even ask better. What's this infantry? Okay. Right. So okay. So they. And what are these? Right. Okay. So I don't need them yet. So I do. I want these. So I want. I want these. Okay. So I might as well get six of them. There we go. And okay. Use my. Put some food in the table and some awards. Right, now, obviously, we can't do the um, PvE, but we do need to um, upgrade my resources as quick as possible. So, let's see what we need to upgrade. Upgrade that. Yes, please. Okay. And also upgrade this as well. Yep, upgrade that. Uh, yes, please. And also, if I can, I'm going to go to build resources, and I want to build another... Yep, I want to build some more farms. Thank you. That down, that would be down there. Build that. Um, okay. And anything else I can build? That's it. Build some that as well. Another, another. Nope. Hang on. That's another look. At, oops, that's another look at that again. That's what's this one? I can't remember what this one does. Um, increases my storage rate. Yeah. Yes, we do. We do want that as well. So we'll have that as well. You put that down there for the time being. There we go. That's another one. Okay, so there we go. Um, are my troops done? My troops are done. Um, so, 
and they are already, already built so and as we're now going to be short on resources again I suppose it's off to go we're going to find somebody else so let's never go at this and troops remain ah okay that's a nice looking thing to tell me I've got three left to go um, out of six um, do I do a quick re yes use a quick gold feck it there we go okay he's got six troops that's all I need to probably upgrade my so look, I can't upgrade them yet. I don't have enough money resources. Okay, um, hmm, let's have a look. Okay, and what about upgrading that as well? I suppose that means giving more troops. Yep, so I need to upgrade that as well as soon as I possible. How much? And that's cost me 2,000 to upgrade that, so... Okay, right, so go to fight. And let's look, look, I'll look at this gen challenges. And no, I can't do anything yet. So, out of curiosity, how much is my upgrade to I see to keep age two? Two thousand seven hundred fifty. So I definitely need to upgrade my storage. Okay, so I might as well go to battle and find somebody else. Okay, and whoa, that looks a bit meaty. There's a two corner. There's two corner areas there though, so that's good. And we've got over there two towers. Three towers. There's one over there as well. Right. Um, okay. Let's have a go. Deploy troops. Attack. Okay. So, um, there we go. And go, go, go to there, folks. And they laid siege to the tower quite quickly. Excellent. And then it's a matter of raiding them good yards, uh, raiding the goods at uh, good yards, them farms and etc. etc. So away they go. And that's it. I, I'm saying I'm raiding it just purely for resources at the present moment. Um, let's actually try. Now selecting trips is a bit awkward, and it's actually I'm trying to get trips to go after sitting buildings. So go for the buildings, folks. Go, go for the buildings. There we go. So yeah, that's a little bit awkward to try and do. Okay, and then they can take that out. I'm more concerned about, I want the resources, and that one over there, please. Oh, I better take out the keep, actually, take out the trips out, so I just noticed that. So, if I will, in a men, get my trips, once I take these two out, go around the other side and take out the castle. But I mainly first want the resources here, and then go around here. And round that way. No, that way, folks. Go on. There we go. Round that way. That's it. Round that way you go. In fact, will you do that? You go in there. That's it. Oh, guard. Oh, yeah, we've got guard troops as well. Hey, that's going to be okay. Where are they going? They can, they can nail that. I hope they will nail them quick enough. I have been. They nail. I hope they nail the trips. Yes, no, they nail. Yeah, they nailed. Okay, and yep, around there, and you go attack that area. They yeah, haven't. Go on, get attack them. Attack them. Go on. So they move a bit like the spy troops and that, etc. Um, the spy troops, the drone troops and that in uh, um, Alliance and Empires. I lost my troops. Shit. There's a fight going on here now. This is going to be interesting. How long is this fight going to last for? And they're dead. Yep. Okay, so they're going for the tower. Hmm. Go for the tower. <laughs> so I have to remember that in future. Watch out for the um, um, uh, troops. I'm hoping I've done this right because I might lose out against them towers because there's two there. But it's going down slowly. But even if I lose, I've got resources, which is the main thing I'm after. I'm just waiting for resources. Doesn't matter if I don't win because I haven't got to the castle really enough to defend with. Um, hmm, I'm going to leave my trips anyway, so there go, battle complete. And I defeated. But I got resources, which is the main thing I was after. 
And there we go, so we, we literally maxed out there. And that's been upgraded my farm has. Yes, it's been upgraded to level 2. That's level 1. So, onwards, right. Um, next thing to do will be, I think, to carry on upgrading my, uh, upgrading my base. Um, but for the time being, I'll leave it there. And I will uh, come back to it later on and show you a little bit more as a room as an upgrade but um, yeah I'm not sure what to make of this quite yet because it um, I wasn't too chuffed with the PVE side of it where you can't um, engage in that first you have to literally go straight into PVE, uh, PvP that's something I'm not too bad with I like the idea of where you can move your troops around that's an novelty idea um, so I'm going to try another video of this. I want to see what you guys think um, now, after you've seen a little bit more of the game. Do you still hate it, or do you think that maybe Microsoft are onto a possible winner? Let me know in the comments below, and also let me know if you want to see more videos of this, because if you don't, then I might not do any more. If you do, then I will do. So anyway, folks, thanks for watching, and I will see you again soon for another video. Goodbye for now.